now a convicted murderer in Lafayette. He was on trial for the shooting and killing of his wife's brother and mother in 2017. The jury's guilty verdict came in a little bit after 5 o'clock tonight. News 18's Kayla Sullivan was in the courtroom. She joins us now live with a look at how many years he's facing. Kayla? Jeff Navarrete faces 95 to 150 years in prison. His sentencing date will be decided a week from today. Now, during the trial, witnesses, DNA, ballistic, and digital evidence put Navarrete's gun, car, and phone at the scene of the shootings. Though prosecutors aren't required to prove a motive, they did provide texts and witness statements to show Navarrete did not get along with the victims. After the murders, Navarrete Navarrete wrote a letter apologizing to his daughter and to God for his, quote, horrific acts. He also called 911 and said he needed to go to jail nine hours after the shooting. Now, the family of the victims didn't want to go on camera, but they did want to say that they are thankful that there is justice for their family. Prosecutor Patrick Harrington says he's thankful to the family for their cooperation, as well as the Lafayette Police Department and the High Tech Crime Unit who helped gather the evidence in this case. Reporting live at the Tippecanoe County Courthouse, Kayla Sullivan, News 18. Kayla, thank you. We're just hours away now from the first significant snowfall of this winter season. Chief Meteorologist Chad Evans joins us now with a look at kind of a, bump, a bumpy 